Hey guys, it's Digidude22 here for logging in for the Stream Riders with another part to YOLO. In the last episode, we beat a manhandler. We raised the death counter through the roof. And, uh, yeah. Before we get started here, I want to explain a few things because this is a quest, a custom quest in Zelda Classic. Um, this one has its own story, and whatever happened to the rest of the Triforce? Well, once upon a time, Ganon and his minions were up to no good when suddenly Ganon. Ganon made a silly error. He misspelled his own name. The grammar Nazi gods were displeased and locked him away in the evil jar. Ganon discovered that the only way to escape the evil jar was to perform a difficult maneuver called triforcing. Unable to escape the jar on his own, Ganon began causing trouble in the far-off land of Jeez to Dif Difficultia to catch the attention of Alright, so with that fancy intro out of the way, I don't want to go into this whirlwind again, and I don't think I have to. Nope, I got the magic container there last episode. Okay, so where else is there to go? I've explored the the sky. That was nice. Some extra rupees. And I've explored three dungeons already. Well Aside from that little other place that I got myself into back at the, uh... Um... Phantos Lair. There is... One other place that we haven't been to yet. And that would be down here, back at the entrance. On this very first screen that we were on. See the Moblin? Yeah, he can only be touched by the... The... Arrows. And let's jump over this fire. This is Chapter 4 in which the final showdown occurs. Good stuff. Now, remember back at Fando's area, there was a pond of healing water. Well... It's in here as well. Which is great. Outstanding. And what's over here? If you give me some cash, I may tell you how to kill Ganon. Hmm. Here. Have one. My lips are sealed. Hmm. You're not very nice. I'm trying to give you money here. So, let's try giving him five. <laughs> no. Gee, thanks. You're friendly. Friendly Garayas. Oh well. So I guess we gotta give him the most amount of money. Which would be 50. Okay, listen up. Because I'm only saying this once. 
Ganon might look all tough, but he has one major weakness. He inexplicably changes colors. When he's blue, hit him with a silver arrow. But I'm fresh out of silver arrows. How am I supposed to beat him? Oh boy. Well... This is pretty cool. I'll just go ahead and take a quick save there, and how come I'm walking on a pit? Well... Okay. Take this sword. If you lose it, it's gone forever. Really? What type of sword is this? Well, this happens to be the level 4 sword. This is the Master Sword. And once again, we're just gonna walk on a pet. Take this arrow. You need it to slay Ganon. So, that's where we get our silver arrow. Thank you. Thank you very much. Alright, well, I hope we're ready, prepared for a boss gauntlet. Oh my gosh, that's one giant Gliak. Whoa. Okay. This boss fight is all about patterns. Oh, and the sword beams don't even affect him. Just gotta know the timing of when to jump to avoid things. That's pretty much it. Fireballs coming from the two split off heads and then there's this one that's just spinning around. Beating Gliak, we run into the second boss that we had to face, the Aquamentis. And this, this style of fireballs looks familiar. Alright, yeah, stupid. I can't use my sword beams on him. Oh boy, ow. Alright, I have no bombs! Whoopsies. Ugh. Don't do that to me, Aquamentis. Oof. Stop killing me. I said, stop killing me! Gee whiz! There we go. And with him out of the way, the spiral fireballs leave as well. And so Dungeon 3's boss... Sure, there was a boss gauntlet, but the main boss was a manhandler. And I'm so glad this one doesn't use wizard type attacks. Oh boy. This one's actually a bit trickier, but the timing is actually really... really easy to jump and avoid. Oof. Unless you want to run into those fireballs. Okay, that's good. That's two down. Two more to go. I don't know if you have to kill the actual body along with it, but... 
E aí... Yeah. Okay, fine. Be that way. I guess I'm at a bad vantage point. Hmm. Wonder why he's not dead yet. Uh, game glitched out on me? Apparently it didn't. Okay, that was good. Whew, that was close. A patch of healing water was being guarded by Manhandler. Oh, goody. Oh, goody, goody, goody. So, with that, I think, I think it's time to go on to the next room. And while we do, I'm gonna let past me, past me is going to be taking over for a bit, so. So, you have come. I've been waiting for you. Hero of Three Force. I've been banished to this jar for so long. But now that you have come, I can finally break free. Lend me your power. Teach me to try Force. I just need the code. Give me the code. Give it to me now. Like this? No. It can't be. You can't try for us. You cannot save me. You are useless. You must die. Thank you, past me. Very well done. Yeah, yeah. In case you were wondering, I used the... the previous voice clip that I used for Ganon back when I originally LP'd this. I added a few sound effects, a few touches here and there. But anyways, this is the... Uh, Ganon? No, this looks like the jar from... from Link's Awakening. I like that little reference you got you put in there. Back from the past. This was level 2's boss, I think. There we go. And he likes to teleport around once you've hit him. Also note the epic background music taking place for this boss fight. This is actually the final boss theme from the Game Boy game, Donkey Kong 94. Released in 94 for the Game Boy. And if you want to see a very cool Let's Play of it, go check out Proton Chan right, right now. He's doing a great Let's Play of it right now. Um... He's trying to upload once every week with it, but, uh, yeah. It'll be at this p 
hard in the game in no time. I can't wait for that. Oh, I missed. Hey, see. No, no, no. Why do you want a boomerang? You stink. Okay. So, let's see here. At, at a certain point in this fight, you're supposed to shoot the jar with an arrow. I think it's... No? I think it's when the jar freezes. Like, you slash it with a sword, and there we go! Okay then. At least I think that... Yeah! Cool. Okay. And we get a little Ganon plushie. Uh, is this a collectible item? Whoa, 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 not this time. I don't want, I don't want to fall into your trap. Huh. Well, I guess we got to. <laughs> 